okay so here these are the steps right so for the first step if we want to go to fundamental course we need to go to this link right so yes go to this link okay and uh, this link will give us all the courses and it needs to be uh, log in with our account also okay one time you can create an account and it will send an FA, mfa and all so here in the search you can say csa right so csa fundamental on demand this is the one we need to select okay and just verify uh, the amount it should be zero it's, it is not 300 it's zero okay, because it's free and now it is october 30 is the date very good and now uh, how to take it more this one huh? start mm -hmm. sorry start so when I say start, it will ask to, initially it will say cross mark, you have to open it and then say accepted it. That's for both the links. Okay. Yes, very good. And then accept this and then enroll. Huh? Yeah. yeah. Enroll. Okay, it is enrolled. Yeah, so this is the course, right? Yeah. So now it will take 15 hours of time. So I need to go each one and then complete it. And this is the first action, huh? web based is this one. Or this can be done last also. Yes. Uh, so once you complete, once we complete the course, then after we have, we will get the voucher in our profile voucher session. Okay, so here, in profile, this is the voucher, huh? No, in profile, huh? There is under my achievements. Uh -huh. Okay. And uh, my achievements, very good. I didn't have any vouchers, so it is not showing, right? Yeah, in my profiles, there is an option of my vouchers. We can check over there. Okay. Okay. Good. So if I complete that 15 hours course, then I will be seeing one voucher here. Yes, right, right. And, and uh, yes, ma'am. Yes, take. take after it. that, after that, once you get the voucher for taking the examination, we need to create the WebSR account. Huh. So the link previously, which you showed, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We need to go over there. And then create a WebSR account, and then. Yeah. Once you yeah below there is option of create a new WebSR login. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. So we have to create the account. Yes. And after creating the account, it will take 24 hours to activate this account. You will get a mail. Okay. Okay. Once you get the mail of your WebSR account activation, you need to add this WebSR account to your ServiceNow profile. Uh -huh. So, that so you have to go to your ServiceNow profile. Okay. And under profiles, uh, there is a option of, uh, below there is option of my preferences. Uh-huh. In my preferences, there is option of WebSR email. My preferences. Just yes, below this. Yeah, WebSR is under. Uh, WebSR yeah, email under. address. Okay. Yeah. So there, whatever we keep there, we need to use it here and then. Uh, yeah. Yeah. You need to just submit it. You need to, uh, like, if, in this your account, it's already a linked uh, WebSR email address. So it's showing uh, some address. But if it's not linked, it will be blank. So you will have to put your WebSR email address. And then submit and it and then submit and it will also take approx 15 to 20 hours to get linked yeah 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 understood and if it doesn't get linked then you will have to raise a case with service now yeah. uh, uh, to like uh, with the issue right right got it ma so yeah. this is uh, <coughs> like a act okay web assessor and linking this one but many mm -hmm. people are coming to me and asking like okay sir i started my training and uh, it got stuck somewhere 99 percent 92 percent and i am not able to proceed further so yes for that also uh, you need to raise a case with service now they will uh, there is a help section above right in our profile okay there is a help section in help section uh, uh, you have to create raise a case create support case hmm. yeah you have to raise a case and you have to tell them that you have completed each and every section and still it's showing 99 percent and all 
so you have to raise this case you have to provide the screenshot how much percent completion your course is showing and uh, they will uh, you know solve the issue and uh, instead of like uh, cases might take some time to get resolved so for that there is another option once you raise a case at that mo same time there is a email address certificates dot uh, certifications dot service now dot com so uh, you have to mail with the same case number and the same issue to this uh, mail address okay okay so this would be a little faster than waiting for 24 hours right yes yes they take action properly uh, for this uh -huh. okay got it uh, got it so yes so and what else what other issues will come uh, what other issues uh, are like uh, you first thing people first? People are saying I completed yes. this one, but it's show, still showing seventy five percent and all. Like, is there any issue with stimulator? No, no. Uh, basically, the issue same happened with me too, but uh, there is only like uh, they can resolve the issue. Okay, so this is the best way. Raise a case and then send them. They will be ready to do it. Yeah, if you are hundred percent sure, and there is a uh, point to check, like if you have completed that portion or not. Go to your own, own learning, like the course that we were doing. Okay. We can check over there. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, going on. Give me a minute. Yeah. yeah um, there is a line, right? Green line uh, showing uh, uh, like in the extreme left side, link your WebSR account. There is a green line, like uh, uh, from where the name. Yeah. So it will show like your uh, this part is completed or not. Below one. Yeah. Okay. No percentage. It will show just uh, beside this service now fundamental on demand. There will come a circle and it will uh, indicate the percentage, percentage one. Huh? But yeah, if you have to check which section you have completed or which one it, you have not completed, hmm. so this green one will be blank, like whitish kind of. Okay. But if you complete it, it will get green, like Complete so you able to trace it. Like if by mistake you have missed something. Right, right, right. Understood, understood. So understood, ma'am. Maybe I can add some screenshot. Uh, yeah. Okay, so good. And so these are the normal issues. So if you get stuck there, maybe you can raise a uh, case and then uh, send a mail to them. Okay. Uh, just to correct the mail address, uh, certificate at the rate servicenow.com. That's it, na? Certificate. No, no. Certificate. Certificate. Uh. certificate. This one? At the rate servicenow.com. Just we need to uh, yeah, remove this icon. Okay. Certificate at the rate. Yeah, just copy. Okay, ma'am. Super. Thank you. And uh, there would be no issues. If we see any issues, we have to uh, go in a way. Like, so like this you are saying, right? So somewhere you can see green and then I think I got it. I think uh, it, it is easy. Yes. Yeah. 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 Okay. That's all I think. Yeah. One and, can use. Uh, after this, so fundamental course is completed. Voucher you got it. And then uh, attach the web basis server. Web basis you can attach any time. Not like once you complete it. Yes, yes, you can also do it now. Do it now, Make because it will take 24 hours now, and this is yes, also yes. covered. Yeah. And yes, and once, yes, this is done. So, prereq for exams, uh, maybe I can send the dumps to them, or people who want it, they can go through the dumps, and uh, maximum questions will come from dumps only, right? Yes, yes. And uh, finish the exam. So, once you finish the exam, how, how like when they will send this one, and how they will send the certificate? Uh, no, it will get updated in your profile and you will get a mail uh, regarding the same also. Web series profile, right? Uh, no, this learning profile only. In uh, this learning profile, yeah. uh, there is an option of... Uh, one second. <laughs> my certificate. My achievements. Right? My yeah, achievements. It, I think I have it. See. Uh, 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 my achievements and under my achievements, uh, we have my certifications. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, right. I can see my certifications like Delta. Got it. Yeah. This one, right? Yeah. yeah. Good. So yes, and uh, one last question. Maybe this is the most asked question. So when you are giving exam, how you did it? Like how so? How much time it took it for you? It is 12 minutes, right? Because you prepared yeah, exams yeah. and all. Okay. Yeah. And uh, how many questions? Uh, 60 questions. So 60 questions. And how much time? Uh, it was 90 minutes. 90. Minutes. Except this, uh, uh, what we call. Uh, external verification because I took online proctor examination. Okay, but uh, what are the options for exams? So if I want to do it from my uh, this one, uh, personal laptop with inbuilt camera, can it be done? No, no, you need an external camera too. 
okay so i can get one external camera and then attach it and then only give or else go out and then give it in a uh, yes center, center. Take so it the center. center central how we will know ah uh, there is a option to check uh, like while scheduling the examination uh, either before if you want to see the centers uh, there is a site of rest on One second, and yeah. Uh, there is a site for this. Uh, locate this? test center. Uh, locate test center. Uh, Cratorian Global Testing. I'll just send a link. This one, ah, uh, promote it, Look. You can tell. You can tell me, ma. Locate test center. Center. Uh, K R Y T R I. Okay. Ah, this uh, one, first one. This one. First one. Okay, okay. So okay. here uh, you can select the center and. Uh, okay. Good. Yeah, here you can check like in your area which ever center is there. Uh huh. Right, like this. I, this is this is the nearest center, right? I can uh, yeah, yeah. go to that and give it. And if I book it, if I go directly, they I can give it, right? Or do I need to book it and then go? No, no. You need to book it from your Webisar account. Uh -huh. uh, we need to uh, uh, like uh, there are two kind of examination: online proctored or center examination. Okay. So if, if instead also if you are taking from a test center, you have to book it from Webisar account. Okay. For both online and for both test center, you have to book it from your webisar account. Uh -huh. Okay, ma got it. And then uh, on that time, you need to go and then uh, yeah, got it, got it. Yes, yes. Very good. Ma they will ask for two ID proofs for online center and uh, for uh, uh, for center. And if you are taking from your home also, you will have to provide one ID proof to them. Okay, two ID proofs. If it is center, right? Yeah. Uh, two ID proofs per center, and if it is not a form, then one ID proof. Yes, one ID proof. Okay, ma, very good. Super. And the camera setup of webcam should be uh, that position so that your laptop screen and your face should be visible to them. Uh, the external one, right? Yeah. It's, okay, because even at home also we need to do using external, so the external should cover both. Okay. Uh, yeah. Person and screen. Screen, yeah. They will verify this one before the exam. Yes, starts. yes, yeah. And finally, finish the exam and then congratulations. Very yes, yes. And uh, one voucher, one time. That's it. Yes, yeah. If it. we miss it, then you have to register with some other account and then again do 15 hours course. Yeah, yeah. Very good, ma. Very good. I think almost we covered, na? Anything we missed it? Uh, no, I think we almost covered everything. Okay. And the base part is if you are taking the examination from your homes, uh, so you have to be extra cautious because uh, sometimes the ID proof which we saw, na, they click picture with them. So if autofocus is not on or something like that, they cancel the examination. And okay. like it took me 30 minutes for me for this verification of my whole room and oh. 10 minutes for uh, examination, oh. 12 minutes for examination and 30 minutes for verification. Oh my God. And if you go out, that is easy, na? Ah, that's it. Do that's and then they will just send it. Yeah, you have to just sit it and all. Ah. Nothing to do. Okay, then we do at home. Very good. So that's why we should not give our other other card photo. If we give other card <laughs> photo, they will match it and then they will say fail. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's why we have to see it. So like pan card or something. <laughs> Even pan card also like that is like very old, what, twenty years back. <laughs> But yeah. Makes sense. They will verify very properly, and then they will allow, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, my dear. And also in online examination, uh, once you have chosen the online examination, na, you will come uh, in your Webisar account under the assessment section. Mm -hmm. You will get the option of uh, <coughs> okay. uh, downloading a browser uh -huh. before the examination. Keep the browser downloaded. You have nothing to do. There is an exe file. You have to download it and run it. Uh -huh. The browser won't be seen in your system anywhere. Don't try to search it as I did it. Uh -huh. I downloaded and I tried to search it like I thought like it's not installed. But the browser will only open once your exam will get launched. It uh -huh. will take from back in. Okay, okay. And, so uh, the other thing, identify and open it. You know? Yes, yes. Uh -huh. yeah. that is and uh, the other thing is biometric. You can do the biometric like by clicking a picture of yours. Okay. Uh, yeah. 
you can do this these two things before the examination this two work you know very good uh -huh. these and all will be like uh, maybe yeah understood understood yeah lyrics of the examination yes very good okay ma i think we covered pretty much i think this one will help so many people they are asking many questions i think we almost covered it right now yeah yeah okay dear so thank you